What's up everybody, Evan Yon here with week 3 of Fortnite Season 8 and it seems that there's no pattern to what they're doing with the weekly challenges. So last week they added one character, Raph, right? And this week they added two characters, Grim Fable and Big Mouth. They actually added a third character called Dynamo Derby, but apparently they're not showing up for us. Right now it's a glitch so they decided to just auto complete the challenge for everyone so we'll see maybe he is on the map but you can't do the challenge you can't see the punch card i don't know so let's just do grim fable and big mouth oh yeah on this video i'm, I'm also going to talk about the the updates 18.10 because for the first time in a long time they decided to actually tell us what changed in the game so first off they added chili chug splashes these work exactly like the old chug splashes so they give you health and shield when you throw it at your feet you can also heal your friends at the same time but now it gives you the chili power so you can run fast you and your friends can run fast it's an exotic item you can only find it on loot llamas and you can buy it from the brat also chug cannons have been replaced with chili chug splashes on loot llamas so you can't find them on loot llamas you can only find them with the brat apparently so with that addition they also added the og chug splash so it's gonna be you're gonna find it as normal loot so that's great kind of like those and there's this little message they have if you're stopping by steamy stacks something weird i noticed there's a big hole at Steamy Stacks. Was there an, inch, an accident on the job? Did something escape from the ground? Could be something for you to investigate. So you can, you can see on the map here. You can see the hole and you can see that the thing dragged out of there. Like it's a worm or something. I'm going to show you. So here's what Steamy Stacks looks like. Look at the hole. It's pretty big actually. Do I get health from this? No. So... Apparently there's a cube right there. I don't know if you saw that. Is it the cube? It can't be the cube. So I don't remember where this cube was before. But it can't be the cube because the cube doesn't drag itself like that. Right? And also, you can see the corruption here. I don't think this corruption was here. Because apparently the cubes are corrupting. They're moving and corrupting the, the island. And I don't think this was here. I'm pretty sure. But that wasn't the cube. There's no way. It's got to be a monster. But yeah, so they're teasing something already. It's gotta be a monster, right? A slurp monster or something. But it only dragged down to right here. It makes no sense. Whatever. Maybe it flew? I don't know. Who knows? So super level styles have been unlocked. We can see them here. Metal pass. So here. So we got blue rune for each of the characters. It's the first level. Purple Rune, second level, and Golden Rune, it's the third level, probably getting to 200, level 200, to get everything, and more importantly, they changed how XP works, so XP earned from your daily punch card missions has been greatly increased, so you can see here, it used to be 17k, it's now 30k, so that's great, we've added XP to all shared quests, they still reward bars too. So I imagine the quest, so yeah, there you go. You can see the 500 XP there. So now you can earn a little bit of, a, of XP as you do these quests. I want to see if you, oh, 750 for legendary quests. I wonder how much you get from the rare, uncommon, and epic. It's just 500 maybe. But yeah, you're still going to get bars like you used to. So now, you know, it's a better reason to keep doing these quests. You get a little bit of XP. All new and future character punch cards have substantially increased XP rewards. So as you can see here, the Grim Fable, it used to be, I think at 
the first quest you got 7k or 10k something now they're all 30k same thing for big mouth so it's a total of 150 per character so they say it's new in future so imagine if you didn't do the old ones they're still gonna be the old xp amount because the people that already finished those quests we will be fucked wouldn't have the the extra xp so they're just changing that for the future stuff thankfully or they could have just given us the, the xp but whatever lastly the weekly punch card xp has been slightly reduced this was done to lessen the setback of not completing them so it used to be 65k it's now 50k i personally don't do the second one because i don't have anyone to play with so i guess it's kind of good i imagine most is gonna come from daily punch cards anyway 90k a day pretty good so let's start this grim fable is located on weeping woods Oh my god. So here is Grim Fable hiding the haystack at Clan Corpse. She sells shield mushroom and activate a prop disguise. What? So there are three haystacks on Corny Crops. Here's the first one. You only need one for this challenge. I'm gonna show the other three. The other two. Here's one, two of me. Oh god. And here's the third one. Kinda hidden. So really simple. Easy enough. Stage two of Green Fable. Destroy beds in holly hedges or pleasant park. Each of the houses should have a bed. So it should be very simple. I'm gonna show you them, obviously. You only need three. So I'm gonna get the three that I need here. And then if I can't show all of them, all the beds in both places, I'll show them on uh, battle lamps. Just so you know where they are. So there should be one here. I'm for sure gonna die. There's, there's two in this house. That's three. I'm gonna try showing the rest until I die. And then, you know. one you know I'm not gonna destroy them I'm gonna leave it for someone else maybe they need it well that's a dead body here's another one it should be just one in this house And two in this house. Two again here. We have just this one here. There's nothing on the basement. Yeah, that's it for Pleasant Park. I'm gonna show the rest on Holly Hedges. So here are the beds in Holly Hedges. I think 
I feel like there's more houses here than in Pleasant. I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. So we got one here. And that's it. Another one here. Oh, what's happening here? What the f mm. Yeah, there's nothing here because this was uh, an alien invasion one. So at least for now, there's nothing. Maybe they will bring it back. So here, I think it's only one bed as well. You know what? Maybe a holly hedge is, is not worth it. You're gonna need to go to three houses to do this. Pleasant Park has multiple houses with two beds. So maybe go to Pleasant. Unless I find one here with more than one bed. Okay, there you go, two beds. Well, I'm wrong. Well, that's probably the only house with two beds, right? There's no way the last house has two beds. I think I'm gonna eat more words. Nah, that's just one bed. There's not even one bed. There you go. So, yeah, guys, go to Pleasant. Go to the houses I showed that there's two beds. If you go here, go to this house and that one to get free. That's that. Okay. Stage three collects a harpoon gun. So harpoon guns are back and you can find them, I believe, as floor no, as floor loot and chest loot. But more importantly, you can find them on barrels. And I always liked back when harpoon guns were in the game. You go on craggy cliffs, there's a, sh a lot of barrels there. There's a building with a lot of bar barrels. That's where I'm gonna go now. Wow, I actually got one. So, out of desperation, I came to this captain car truck and I found one. There's three barrels here. But like I said, I'm gonna show you the Craggy Cliffs building. It's way better to do this. But since I can't do challenges on Team Rumble, you know, I'm doing it here. So here is the building I talked about. As you can see, there's a lot of barrels here. So, way more chances for you to get a harpoon gun. There you go, I found one already. Bam, bam, bam. Bam, bam. I think there are more around here, but you should find it. See, I found two already. Should find it. Yeah. So stage four, hunt a wolf. Oh my god, I found wolf. Kill it. Let's try to just kill one because the next stage we're gonna need wild one. There you go. So stage five, emote within 10 meters of wildlife. Let's build it up because they are very aggressive right now. And emote. Did you do it? Did I do it? Come on. There you go. And that's it for... I forgot her name. Green Fable. So... Let me kill So just so you know, this is near Retail Row. Apparently they spawn here, here, and here. Yeah. But, like I always used to say, I love the middle of the map. Right here they spawn, like here, 
We'll do here. A little hard to see. Here. Okay. So all around here, there's a chance you'll find wolves. And this this the emote part, it doesn't need to be wolf. You, you can do it against any wildlife. Next we got Big Mouth. He's located at the tomato restaurant near the orchard. And he sells coconuts and activate prop this guy. Stage one of his quest is open chest in steel farm. You only need two of them and there's three of them on steel farm. Steel farm is actually pretty close from the tomato restaurant. So here we go, steel farm. Oh my god. Oh. We got three chests here. We need two of them. Wow, I got you. So the third chest. So here is the third chest. But stay shoe of Big Mouth, search an ice machine. So if I had survived that encounter, you can go back to the orchard. There should be an ice machine here. There's also an ice machine here on this gas station. You can find an ice machine on every gas station or most gas station. And if you're just in another match, you know, there's a lot of ice machines on Misty Meadows, all over Misty Meadows, and even more on Believer Beach. So I'm sure you can find them. Pretty simple, you just need one. So I'm actually going for this ice box because I was near it for another thing. Stage 3 open ammo boxes at Dirty Docks. So Dirty Docks, the warehouse right here should have a lot of ammo boxes. All over Dirty Docks should have a lot of ammo boxes, but you know. So I'm going to this warehouse here, but the here there's a lot of ammo boxes as well you only need two anyway so it shouldn't be a problem destroy some boxes because sometimes they're hidden okay. same thing here sometimes they're in these boxes look at that so stage or buy a health item from a mending machine. So I'm gonna show you the map of all mending machines. They are mostly on gas stations. And I also found that the weapon medic machines can also be mending machines. So it's kind of randomized. So I'm gonna use this mending machine here, but this is supposed to be a weapon medic machine. So like I said, I think, Normally, mending machines are always on gas stations, but then there are these spots where they can be weapon matic machines or mending machines. So, we need to buy something. I'm gonna buy the cheapest one because I'm cheap. There you go. Stage five search a supply drop. We're gonna have to wait for one to drop and hope for. Oh my god, there's a supply drop. Right here, boys. Nobody's gonna go there. I got a car right here. Oh my god, don't die. Oh, Jesus. There you go, I got really lucky here, guys. So check the map every time the, the circle updates to see if there's a, uh, a supply drop. And if you get lucky and they are outside of the map like this, it's great. 
Again, the challenges are not working on Sim Rumble. Unless you get lucky and you find the character you need in a payphone, which is unlikely. So you gotta do this on regular mode this time. They're not transferring like they used to. But I'm sure you can do it, you know. Just, just look for the supply drop and hope that no one is there, okay? So I think that's it, guys. That's two characters done. I'll see you next week. Who knows what they're gonna do. They added three characters. One of them is broken. Will they add? Maybe they, they wanted to add two characters last week. And they added three to compensate. So maybe every week it's gonna be two characters instead of one. I don't know. Like, it's all, all over the place. We're gonna figure it out next week, okay? So don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like the video, and use code Avignon. See you next week. Goodbye.